This video shows the assembly of a single Maxim 3000 unit by two people. This will be performed by Charlie and Mitch. Lay one to five bases out in a line and place waste tank in the cradle. Assemble toilet seat to tank. Place the toilet seat on the tank and insert the screws through the seat hinge and tank. Attach the plastic nut to the screws and tighten. You may have an alternate seat design that doesn't have an exposed screw on the top of the hinge. You will have to spin on and tighten the seat from inside the tank. Get a left panel and place on base and insert protrusion on inside the panel into pocket of front of base. Place the panel firmly against the base with one foot and install two leg screws vertically into the two dimples in the left front pocket. Repeat the same steps with the right panel. Assembler 1 will get the rear panel and place onto the base. Assembler 2 install the 3 quarter inch screw in the center hole of the 3 on the rear base. Install the same screws on the remaining two holes. Squeeze the two panels together when fastening. Install five of the three quarter inch screws on each side through the rear panels and into the screw clips on the side panels, starting at the middle and working up and down. one leg screw vertically into the dimple of the middle pocket and the same thing in the rear pocket. Then install one leg screw horizontally into the dimple just below the front pocket. Repeat this step on remaining dimples along outer side. Note, only tighten leg screws until rubber washers begin to flatten to avoid stripping. Repeat the same steps to the other side panel. Install the vent pipe in the tank. Push down on the vent pipe to seat it in the tank. Position the roof over the panels and vent pipe. Pull the roof down over the vent pipe from the outside. Check roof to panel location before screwing together. Install the one for the left front corner at this time. To properly seat the tank, have one of the assemblers stand with one leg inside the tank. This person should signal when the screws have tightened the panel to the tank. Install two leg screws in the dimples on the rear panel. Then repeat this on both sides, one leg screw on each side. Pre-drill the dimples for the urinal to number 10 drill bit and a drill bit stop. The dimples for the urinal is located on the left side panel front corner about halfway up. 
place the drain tube of the urinal into the hole in the tank. Insert a number 66 rivet into the urinal and panel to hold its position. While drilling the hole, using the other hole in the urinal top flange as a template. Rivet code hook to the vent pipe using Avdel Silver Expanding Rivet. Position hasp with top of slot closer to jam. Rivet hasp to door jam with two Avdel Silver Expanding Rivets. Drill the dimples for the paper hood, the number 10 drill bit, and a drill bit stop. The dimples for the paper guard hood are located on the right side panel. Drill through only one layer. Rivet paper guard to wall using four Avdel black rivets. Install bottom two rivets first. You will have to push firmly on the rivet gun as you set the rivet to set rivet properly. Insert the spindle into the slot on the end of the paper guard with the hook facing down. Squeeze the open end of the spindle to insert hook into small slot and release. Rivet the black door handle to the door using two Avdel black expanding rivets. Insert the short gray bushing into the pocket in the base. Place long gray bushing onto the top end of the door tube. Place the door spring over the long bushing. Note the position of the loop on the spring. Install the U-nut onto the spring arm loop with the barrel of the U-nut on the door side of the loop. Drill a 11 seconds inch hole for the door spring bolt at the dimple on the outside of the panel. Pick up door and insert bottom of the door tube and into the bushing in the base. The bottom spring arm loop will sit on the floor. Push spring loop to space between panel and base until it snaps down into space. Lift the left front roof corner. Push the upper door tube in place and pull the roof down onto the tube. Carefully push spring arm over until it contacts the panel. Pull down on the roof to trap spring arm between roof and panel. Install the 5 16 by 1 half inch long screw through the 11 32nd hole and into the U-nut on the spring arm. You will need another person on the inside to hold the U-nut. Tighten screw only until the U-nut is approximately 1 8 inch from the panel surface. Pull down on left roof corner and install the two 5 16 by 3 quarter inch long screws horizontally through the roof and into the left panel. Install 5 16 by 1 and a half inch long screw with rubber clad washer into the hole on the top left roof corner. Drill out the two dimples on the right side panel with the number 10 drill bit between the corner and the door opening. The first dimple of the two dimples are located 12 inches down from the roof. Note, be careful to only drill through inside wall only. Remove protective plastic film from near surface. Rivet near to panel using rivets in kit. Drill out the two dimples with a number 10 drill bit on the right side panel. The dimples are located between the corner and the door opening. The first dimple is located 21 inches down from the roof. Note, be careful to only drill through inside wall only. Open the dispenser by pressing in the button on the bottom. Rivet dispenser to panel using rivets and kit. Drill out the few dimples on the right side panel with a number 10 drill bit. The first two dimples are located 12 inches down from the roof in the middle of the right panel. Note, 
Once again, be careful only to drill through the inside wall. Rivet paper towel dispenser to panel with rivets and kit. four dimples with the number 10 drill bit. Two on the right side panel and two on the rear panel in the right hand corner of the unit. The four dimples are located 17 inches down from the roof. Note, once again be careful to only drill through inside wall. Rivet shelf to panel using rivets and kit. the two dimples with the 3 8 inch drill bit on the right side panel between the corner and door opening. Then using the 1 and 1 8 inch hole saw, drill out the dimple in the tank in the right front corner. Place the drain hose from the hand wash into the waste tank and slide hand wash into place. Inserting, flatten the edge of hand wash between the waste tank and the right panel. Using screwdriver, install hand wash to the panel by using a screw, star washer, and flat washer through a hole in the panel from outside and into threaded insert in the hand wash tank. 